Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Taste Buds. I'm your host Abdul and this is Rex. Uh, welcome to Toledo's Espresso Nook and it's located at Crawford Lane. Now Toledo's Espresso Nook is a place that serves all day breakfast. They've got rosties, they've got pastas, they've got sandwiches and they're really well known for their latte art as well. <laughs> Let's get right into the first dish. Alright and here we have the first dish. It's a kind of plain looking dish but goodness you need to smell this because it smells so good and we just it's really want to dig in. I got very lovely pot of sour cream. It looks very nice, doesn't it? Mm. It's literally just soaking in its own juices, which is it just very nice. burst in my mouth. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. So it looks crispy on the outside, a bit more fluffy on the inside, which is what you want, I suppose. I'm gonna put some sour cream on it. I'm gonna try it plain first. Okay. Oh my god. That's good. Mm hmm. I like it with sour cream. The sour cream gives a very nice freshness to it. That's a good breakfast right there. We're gonna move on to the next dish. Alright guys, so now we have the prawn laksa. So the special thing about this is not just any prawn laksa, mm -hmm. it's actually pasta noodles. So okay. we've got sprouts on top, which is a nice thing, but we're gonna mix that up. Yep, let's do it. They have a lot of laksa sauce, which is very essential. Because you've got a lot of noodles, you need to have a lot of sauce, right? Also, I want to say that the prawns are really big. Look they don't that. skip on the size. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. The prawn is really good. The prawn is really meaty. Noodles. The coconut milk really comes through. Like you can taste the laksa leaves, you can taste the actual laksa taste of it. It's not just, you know, egg noodles from the pasta. Alright, All right. on to the next dish. Baby, would you be my all right, so on to our third dish, we have a very nice breakfast platter. It looks very uh, seemingly plain. You got potatoes, you got mm -hmm. toast, you got salad, you got eggs. Now these eggs aren't just any type of eggs. They're actually uh, truffle scrambled eggs. So if you could smell this, my goodness, the truffle is like really wafting up in your face. Mm -hmm. You got a piece of tomato in there as well, which mm -hmm. seems very nice. Oh wow. Oh wow. That truffle, is not what I expected. Yeah, the truffle really hits you straight off the bat. Yeah. That is not what I expected but at all. I expected to chew, and then chew and chew, and then the truffle to hit me, but once you put it in your mouth, it's right there. It just exploded in my mouth. Oh my god. If you like truffles, this is definitely for you, because that's intense flavour. Okay guys, so now we're here with the pandan pancake with the ice cream on top. Uh, powdered sugar and I think that's maple syrup, right? Uh, it might be maple syrup. It might be gula malaka. We're gonna find out mm. when we eat it. Took one piece with a bit of ice cream. Intensely <laughs> fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> Pancakes are warm and the ice cream is really cold. And the contrast really, you know, enhances the overall feeling of the pancakes. Yeah. Very nice, yeah. On to the English. All right, now that we're full, we need to quench our thirst. So we've got three amazing drinks in front of us. We have the avocado milkshake, and this has gula malaka in it. Very, mm. very interesting. Uh, in the middle here, we have an affogato. So this also has gula malaka, like everything else in this restaurant. Uh, it's got a sugar rim. Of course, affogato, if you don't know, is coffee shot with uh, ice cream in the middle. And finally, we have our latte over here. Please see salt caramel latte. So that should be interesting as well. I'm not gonna lie, it just tastes like an avocado milkshake, which isn't a bad thing. I still really like it. I'm not a coffee person, but I would drink this again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can you taste the sea salt caramel? I can taste the caramel, but I'm not really getting the sea salt. Usually I mix this up real nice. Mm. <laughs> uh, yeah. But uh, we gotta conserve some of the you know different tastes, right? Mm -hmm. I'll just have a spoon of it. Oh wow! Oh my god. So the avocado is super strong guys, okay. So it's just a straight shot of coffee. So that's just straight up black coffee. So that's got a super strong taste. But oh you also god. have the ice cream and the gula malaka, which is nice and sweet. So it blends together really, really well. And I really like it. All right, and that is pretty much all the dishes we have here uh -huh. at Toledo's Espresso Nook. Uh, what was your favorite after? My favorite would have to be the Pasta, the, the, with the prawn. Yeah. Prawn laksa pasta. Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, that really packs a punch. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, that was a great one, but I was personally really like rosti. It's hard to get a good rosti around mm. Singapore. So, um, that, those are our favourites. Um, that pretty much wraps up this episode of Taste Buds. And you're watching CTV. 
Your coolest choice.